Hi. There are a lot of tutorials out there on how to make stylized graphs in Blender, but in my experience all of them have some sort of problem. Either they only work on certain types of terrain, don't react to dynamic light, have way too detailed shading, have terrible performance or just don't look that good. But I think I found a solution that solves all of these problems. First of all we need a grass mesh. You can either use individually modeled blades or just two planes with a texture on them. Using textured planes gives you more flexibility when it comes to stylization, but they won't hold up in top-down view, so keep that in mind. By the way, I'll put the textures I use in the description so you can download them and use them if you don't have any. We also need a ground mesh. I just use the ANT landscape add-on that comes with Blender, but you can use any mesh you want. With all of the prep work out of the way, let's hop into the Geometry Notes editor. Most of this stuff is pretty standard and you probably know the drill already if you watched any grass tutorial ever. Distribute points, instance on points, scale, rotate, blah blah blah. But here's where the main part of the magic happens. After distributing points, add a capture and store attribute node. Oh and by the way, I'm still using Blender 361 and I don't know if they renamed these nodes or changed anything in later versions, so if they did, um... That's rough, buddy. Anyways, what we want to do is capture and store the normal attribute from the distributed points. Give the attribute a name and now each instance will inherit the normal information from the surface mesh. This basically means that they will receive light the way the ground would instead of being shaded individually, which results in nice and even shading. So now that we have the normals, go into the shader editor and plug them into a diffuse or principled BSDF node. From here you can go as crazy as you want and use all the cool tricks that other grass tutorials taught you. Rotate the instances with a noise texture, add color variation, scatter some additional stuff like flowers, anything you feel like. With that being said, I don't feel like making this video any longer. Bye!